Hello, boys and girls. How are you doing today? I hope you're doing fantastic. Welcome back to Maple Hill Elementary. I am Mr. J and Fuzzles. How are you doing today? I don't know right now. Oh? And why? What happened? Well, I was building a castle and two friends playing tag came by and accidentally kicked it when playing. And I don't know how I feel about it. Okay. Well... I'm really sorry to hear that your castle got broken. Oh, thank hmm. you. But we well, you know really what? Hard. How about we head inside and talk oh. more about feelings? Oh, okay. Good idea. Welcome inside the green class, boys and girls. This is a really great and fun class to be in. So welcome That's in. Fun. Puzzles, yeah. when we were outside, you were telling us about how your castle got broken, mm -hmm. but you yeah. did not know how to feel about it. No, I don't know how mm -hmm. to feel. Well, there's many different feelings. Oh. <laughs> that is right. And these feelings can belong to four different zones. Four zones? That is right. Yeah. Blue zone, green zone, yellow zone, and red. <laughs> yes. So how about we take a look at all these different feelings and the zones they could belong to. All right, let's take a look. The first zone we're going to look at is the blue zone. Okay, so the first one, blue zone. When we're talking about the zones, we can think about how a thermometer measures temperature. For a blue zone, it's feeling really low. So it's like measuring our feelings temperature, and the blue zone is low. Some of the feelings for a blue zone is when you're feeling tired. I do feel sleepy sometimes. Upset. I don't always like what's happening, and that makes me upset sometimes. Sick. I have felt sick before, and I don't like it. Or sad. Things have happened to me before that have made me sad and cry a little. <laughs> so, Mr. J, what is the next zone? Well, Fuzzles, the next zone would be the green zone. Ooh, the green zone. If we were to measure this zone's temperature, it would feel just right. So feeling pretty good about how things are. In the green zone, you're feeling happy. Aw, oh, happy's a nice feeling. Calm. I feel calm when I'm reading. Feeling okay. I feel okay when everything around me is just right. And feeling like you're ready to learn. It's great when you're at school and you're feeling like you're ready to learn. So, Mr. J, what is the next zone? Well, Fuzzles, the next zone is the yellow zone. Hmm, okay, the yellow zone. So the temperature of this zone is starting to feel a little warm. So no longer a green zone, but starting to feel a little hot. In the yellow zone, you could be feeling frustrated. Something happened and you didn't like it. Worried. I worry about my friends sometimes. A little silly or wiggly. I do get silly sometimes. And losing some control about how you feel. You can't always be in control of your feelings. I'm a little worried about what the next zone could be, Mr. J. Well, Fuzzles, this zone is the red zone. Oh boy, the red zone. The temperature of this zone is feeling really, really hot. When you're feeling in the red zone, you must be feeling like you're boiling. In the red zone is when you're feeling mad or angry. I have felt mad before when someone took a toy from me without asking. You start feeling like you want to be mean to others. When someone's mean to you, it can sometimes make you feel like you want to be mean back to them. You feel like you just want to yell or hit. When you feel so mad, you just want to yell. This is when you feel like you've lost all control of your feelings and maybe your body too. You're so mad that you're not thinking about what you're doing or who you could be hurting. 
A red zone is a tough zone to be feeling. Well, Fuzzles, those were the four zones, and I hope that you learned just a few feelings that go into those zones. As well, there is many other feelings that we could add to those zones as well. <laughs> that is right, many more. Well, Fuzzles, it is important to remember a few things about feelings. Mm -hmm. The first thing we should remember is your feelings belong to you. That is right, your feelings are inside you, and they belong to you. So however you're feeling is how you're going to feel. And that is okay. And as well, the second important thing to remember about feelings is that sometimes we're not always going to be a green zone. Mm -hmm. That is right. Sometimes we're going to have a feeling of a blue zone, a yellow zone, or even a red zone. And it happens. And that is okay because it's your feelings and they belong to you. I think the best thing we could always do though is mm -hmm. if we are in the blue zone, yellow zone or red zone is yeah. to remember we will get back to the green zone and feeling yeah. good. The green zone's mm -hmm. good. That is right. The green zone is good. <laughs> well, Puzzles, I hope you enjoyed the feelings and learning <laughs> oh, a little did, bit today. And I hope you enjoyed that too, boys and girls. Ooh. But it's time to let yeah. you go. I enjoyed oh. our time today. I hope to see you again here at Maple Hill. Yes, Take on. care. Bye for now. Bye, have a great day. Have yourself a wonderful day. Yes. <laughs> yes, this is my favorite song. <laughs> favorite song. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, <laughs> you're still here. Ooh, hoo, hoo. You didn't see anything. <laughs> Don't forget to like and subscribe. <laughs>